Use bond enthalpies to find the enthalpy of reaction for the reaction below. C2H4 plus Cl2 produces C2H4Cl2. <laughs> so I'm going to start with Lewis structures. C2H4 looks like this. So carbon and carbon with four hydrogens. Remember that carbon forms four bonds, so that leaves a double bond here, okay? Plus Cl2 produces C2H4Cl2. So what we're going to do is break this double bond so that we can form C2 H4 Cl2 like this. So I just got to do a little counting. Okay. So this is a little tricky because now we have bonds that are the same on both sides. Okay. So here we have four carbon hydrogen single excuse me four carbon hydrogen single bonds and one carbon carbon double bond we have one chlorine chlorine single bond so those are our reactants and then our products we have one carbon carbon single bond four carbon hydrogen single bonds and two carbon chlorine single bonds okay now let's find our delta h for the reaction so let's start with our reactants so it'll be Four times carbon hydrogen single bond is 413 plus one carbon carbon double bond is 614 plus the chlorine chlorine single bond is 240. Oh, I tried to switch colors and it didn't work. Let me try that again. 242. Those are our reactants. I'm going to put some brackets there just to show we're adding those all together. Then we're going to subtract our products. So we have a carbon-carbon single bond, which is 348, plus 4 times 413. plus two times carbon chlorine single bond 328 okay and again I'll sneak some brackets there so you can see the reactants and the products separated now from here it's just a calculator problem and you could actually simplify this see how you have these four bonds in both places you could cross them out and simplify your calculator math there if you want to you, you figure out how you want to put that in a calculator, but when you do, you get negative 148 kilojoules per mole, which is answer choice B.